Hello, welcome to the Style Chronicles. I wanted to share an outfit of the day with you guys. This is a little summer shorts outfit, something that I wear on the weekends when we go out to eat or just to look a little bit nicer, more put together during the day if we're doing something dinner at El Tiempo on Navigation. If you're a Houstonian, you'll know exactly where that is. It's right outside of downtown in a very historic part of Houston. It's actually where Houston started. Um, but it's a great Mexican restaurant if you guys are looking for somewhere fun and nice to eat um, in Houston. Anyway, we frequent that place quite a lot. Um, but I will show you what I have on back there and then I'll come. <laughs> Camisole, this blue camisole that I have from J. Crew that I'm absolutely loving. It's the scalloped camisole. Loving it. It was a part of my capsule wardrobe. It's actually a part of my wardrobe completely now. I've worn it three or four times since I've had it, and I've only had it about three weeks, no, two weeks. Um, but loving it. It fits so nicely. I think it is going to replace my Barcelona camisoles from Express that they've discontinued. This, I think, um, I'm going to purchase in multiples as soon as they release new colors because I really do like it. Um, so I've just been looking for new camisoles because it's so disappointing when something you absolutely love goes away. It just sucks. Um, so yeah, I'm on the hunt for new camisoles and this one has definitely taken the cake for one of my favorites right now. My shorts are a pair of pineapple shorts. They're white linen pineapple shorts with little gold pineapples. They're from Old Navy and I will link everything down below. This handbag is a Kate Spade bow bag. It is old. I've had it for probably three years now. Um, but it's my absolute favorite crossbody. I like it because of the pop of gold it gives um, to an outfit. It's But it's neutral at the same time, so I like that very much. And when I go out on the weekends, I like to be hands-free because I've always got my kids with me, so I've always got to hold hands when we cross you know, parking lots or just to be able to grab them or carry my daughter. So I always like to have hands-free. I don't really like to have cumbersome handbags that are in the way, especially, like, especially at dinner because I don't have to put it on my chair or on the floor it's just around me the whole time so i really like that my shoes are oldies but goodies they are my sam edelman wedges which i absolutely love um, i've had them for several years as well i will link some that are similar but these are not in stock anymore obviously they're not even being made um, but i am the kind of person that when i find something i like i will literally wear it out and this year my husband encouraged me to find another pair of wedges i don't know if he's sick of seeing these or he knows that it's about time to get another pair because they're getting very worn. But I looked all summer long for wedges that I like and it's very hard to find something that I will wear that I like that is flattering for me um, because I have a very wide foot. So it's a little difficult there um, and I haven't done that yet. Uh, even in the Sam Edelman range, I haven't seen anything. So I'm sticking with these for a little while longer, uh, but I really do like, I like the straps and the wrap up and I like the tan color for wedges for the summer. I just feel like they're so versatile and you can wear them with everything literally and they do elongate your legs when you have on a pair of shorts and wedges or heels in general just make your muscles pop if you're into that <laughs> they make your muscles look stunning um so that on my face i have on max woodwinked eyeshadow in my um eyelid area a pair of ardell wispy lashes they're just 113 wispies um my Cheeks, I have Max Gingerly Blush on, and then I do have some highlight. It is the um, Global Glow Highlight. I just went all MAC today. I didn't realize that I had done that, but I did. Um, on my lips, I have Max Velvet Teddy, which is a very pretty color I really do like. And on top of that, the one MAC thing I did not use 
um, is the Dolly Lipstick from Buxom. It's just a lip gloss. This is a little travel size, um, but the Dolly Lipstick on top of that. I think it's a real pretty kind of little mauvey color for that brown um, velvet teddy color. Um, so that is what I have on my face. My earrings are Kendra Scott. They're just the white with the silver. I like the juxtaposition of mixing things. So because I have white shorts on, I wore white earrings. And because I have a lot of gold on, I wore silver. Um, that's just kind of, I don't know. I like mixing things. Um, I have my wedding ring and my watch on. And that is it. I hope you guys are doing fine. My uh, week so far has been okay. Have not started back to school shopping, which I'm getting a little antsy about. I know I need to really dragging my feet on that. I don't know why, I just can't get to it this year. I feel like it's not August, it's not August. I need to, but it's August now, so I need to, it's crazy. Um, and, um, but definitely need to. And I hope you guys are doing well. I am still in the process of letting my hair just kind of fill in. It got a little too thinned out there. This was not connecting anymore, and I don't like that. I don't like when there's this big triangle and a flap of hair. Um, I like for it to be very like, blended and just look really pretty. Having short hair so much, it's such a low maintenance. I can work out and not feel like I need to wash my hair all the time because it's long and it's you know got all this sweat in it. Um, so anyway, the um, last time I had it trimmed last weekend, she just really cleaned up my neckline back here so that it wasn't all crazy. And she didn't even touch the sides. She just really kind of blended this in a little, but she's letting the weight grow back so that it'll lie the way that I like for it to. And she did take a little bit off the front, a little too much. I like it a little longer, um, but I'm just in that process of growing it out. So hopefully within the next two months, it'll get back to the state that I really, really like it in where it's real, you know, it's stacked, but it's still real full and kind of long. And then this is longer and real full, but definitely angled and um, cut just better. And it'll be the weight of my hair that does that, holds everything in place. So anyway, that is an update on my hair. I hope you guys are having a wonderful week so far. Thank you so much for watching and for subscribing. I really do appreciate it. And I will talk to you guys later. Bye-bye.